Hey there guys, today I have for you Jack's specific 4 inch egg robo. And uh, this is the wave with the uh, SPO. I don't have an SPO because I just got this one. So yeah, uh, action looks nice. He comes with a gun, one of his guns. And he has 13 points of articulation. Here he's like some of them being demonstrated. So yeah, let's read the bio. Egg Robo is an egg-shaped robot and is one of the more powerful badniks. So yeah. Yada yada, Egg Robo with blaster. So yeah, let's get him out of the box. Oh man, I had a whole debacle with this guy trying to find one in the box so I can unbox him. Yeah. The guy tried to scam me. By the way, just to get this, so I could get this figure. He tried to scam me. That's what you get when you buy stuff off of eBay. People want to scam you. Cause like, where are you gonna find an egg robo nowadays? You can't. And especially an inbox one. You can't find one nowadays. Just because like a, a sensible one too. So yeah. Um, here he is, Egg Robo. And yeah. If you do not know, I have reviewed its brother before. Heavy, uh, Heavy Gunner. And, uh, I've reviewed him before. Just in an old review by itself. So yeah. I'm trying to get him to pose, but. So hard to, he's kind of stiff, and he has a giant gun. So yeah, uh, why don't we talk about this guy first? Then we'll like compare him later. So yeah, here he is, Egg Robo. He looks, mu he feels much lighter than the other one back there, and uh, he can also mimic. He can also uh, do his pose from Sonic, Sonic the Hedgehog three, and Knuckles. Oh my God. Can I get this in? It's supposed to go in. It's the whole point of a gun. There we go. Come on. Get in. There we go. I got his gun in. Just a hollow piece of plastic. Ah, there we go. Oh, my fingers killing me. So yeah, uh, he has a gun in his hand. And he has one open hand and one hand for holding gun. And here's what the gun looks like. You can't do anything. It's just a holding device. It's just a thing to hold for him. It comes with a jetpack that you can remove. Right? You can remove it. Oh yeah, you can. You can remove it. He's also hollow on the inside. He's hollow on the inside. Just like his brother. Except this one is not that hollow with, but he's a little more dense. You can also swip, switch out their jetpacks. It's kind of loose fit, but you can if you want to. Swip, swap it out. So yeah. I don't want to break anything. I don't want to break anything because I've break and broken these figures before. Not these ones, just different ones. So yeah, there we go. All put together. So yeah, he's got a bend at the knee. Ah, uh, god damn it. Uh, I can't move his leg. I can't move his legs, they're stiff. Man, this is just like Chaos Sonic. His legs were stiff, I can't, can't move them. Uh, well, at least his feet look nice. Look at that, look at that design, that detail in his feet. So yeah, you can move his head, you can't move his waist. And you can't. You can move his legs. You're supposed to be able to move his legs, but I guess you can't on mine. Yeah. So yeah, they're the same exact figure. Just this one's a little taller, probably because you know. Hmm. Uh, they don't have pupils. I don't know why they just don't have pupils. And the detail in this is really good. It's very good. So yeah. I don't know. This is annoying. Just not being able to move these. This is a nice figure for building out your army of badniks and uh, 
Eggman's army. It's good, you know, to fill out your army. Just buy a bunch of these guys. If back in the day you could buy a bunch of these guys and have a giant army of them. Yeah, they're this is a good figure. I heard they came out with a 2.5 inch version, and I'm excited. I, I hope I can find that one without wasting my entire life savings on it. But yeah. So that was my review on uh, the Jack specific 4 inch Egg Robo. Thanks for watching. Bye.